Hey everybody, it's Cappy Smack, and we're back in Dual Universe. All right, once again, I'm going to check my mining equipment to make sure everything is running because if you're playing this game for the first time, this is what you're going to be doing. You might dream of flying a ship in space, but those are expensive. And trust me, you have no idea how to build one. Wow, the sheer physics of the thing will blow your mind, lean out of your shoulders. And today I've got to fly one of my characters over to grab some ore or everything will come to a stop. But if you're new in the game, don't worry about doing that, because you can't. You can dream about doing it, you can want to do it, you can look at the pretty night sky. You can put your ore in the market. And dream of the day when somebody might swoop down and buy it. Keep in mind, the people who have the money don't really care how much ore you might have. Is they're too busy grabbing it cheap off the market. Ore is cheap, and things you want to buy after you sell your ore is not. I don't call that a healthy economy. That's more like not a healthy economy. Oh, I gotta grab this stuff soon. It's gonna be a hundred percent. Let's just go very soon. I feel like the game sounds are not really there. Maybe they are, maybe they're not. I don't know. I'm going to turn down quite low. Hmm. That could be. It might be making game sounds. I don't know. But you're not here for the game sounds anyway, right? You're here to watch me do the one thing you're going to be doing a lot if you're new in the game. Which is making sure your mining equipment is running. But meanwhile, you're going to want your 150k per day. Now, obviously, I've got more than that because, you know, I haven't been playing in a long time. Which is always an option. I mean, if you want to subscribe to the game and then come back in a year, you might actually have some money. Uh, 150k per day is like, what, 52 million per year or some shit?
54 million in a year. Now, after a year of subscribing and not playing, you would probably have enough money to buy a ship. Maybe. Assuming someone's making them. And they feel like delivering it to you. Or you can hop on the shuttle and go to Alioth and then find their tile and then buy it and then hope you know how to fly it. So what's my audio doing? That's 100%. Huh. Hey, I kind of like that. Okay, it's in the wrong place, though. Okay. And now we're back. 
to it's in the wrong place. Because I didn't want to lock it, I wanted to turn that off. Oh, alright. Well, um, let's rename this. Call that screen capture, and then let's duplicate it. And call this game capture. And then let's put this right here. And screen capture, we'll get rid of game capture. And game capture, we get rid of screen capture. And then I feel like, uh, what the hell was I doing? I even shut them out because, oh uh, yeah, I need to, need to move this around a bit and uh, transform it. Which I forgot to do. Okay. Alright, I can live it up. Super cool. Now I switch screens, you don't get to know. Not like you wanted to see that anyway. I'd imagine someday I might get my shit together, but you never can tell. And now uh, what's going on with the audio? I don't know. Because I'm pretty sure uh, I messed that up. Possibly when I change some things, which you never can tell. I'm not sure if that's working better or not. Mm -hmm. Like I said, someday I might get my shit together. Hey, when are you going to play the game? Yeah, give me a break. This is the game. They give you one teeny tiny mining unit when they give you your own little house with a landing pad when you first get in this game. And you are expected to use that one 
to try to get enough money to get another one. And if you are so fortunate enough to get another mining unit, then you're supposed to dutifully watch both of them. Meanwhile, you look up at the stars and wonder what it's like to fly a ship in the game. And keep in mind, everything I have here, you will probably never have. Hey, I got down to 150k. 2.5 2. million. Which is still not enough to buy a ship. If you want to buy a ship, it's not enough. If you were wondering if you want to get into the game, if you're not in the game, <laughs> this game is in beta. I can assure you they have no idea what they want this game to be. Um, just in case you were wondering. I mean, if you want a fun game... And if you want to give yourself the best ship in the in, in the galaxy, you can do that on the PC. Now you can you can glitch your way there on the console, but you're not going to get to edit the, the save file. And that's the joy of being in an offline game. It used to be there there was a glitch I used in Dual Universe. And then they called it cheating. Did they fix the glitch? No, they just said, when you use it, you're just cheating. So not only are these developers too lazy to understand what the fuck they should be doing, they're too lazy to fix their glitches and too lazy to understand what people want to do with their fucking game. Now, if you want to be all about, you're going to play the game the way I want you to play the game, and you're going to give me money in the, along the way, I mean, okay, maybe. I mean, are you going to get a lot of playtime out of people that way? I don't know, maybe not. Some hardcore people will do it. I'm just here to show you what it is. So how many runs do I have left on this thing? Thirteen forty-seven runs out of 2,500, so... Half the runs that I put in here every day. And that's only because I have limited storage.
I still think it's not really enhancing the game. Neither is it making the game more fun. Oh, you can hear game audio. Okay. All right, so 26, 15, I probably need more coal. Still not making Kurgon. Why are we not making Kurgon, man? Uh, missing inputs. Oh, because I don't have calcium refiner running. Where's that? That's right there. And he needs schematics. So was I, was I doing that? T2 pure? I was doing that. No, oh, we have to do that. And then maybe we'll get some calcium run for 40 runs. That'll be awesome, man. 40 whole runs. And he's missing inputs. Otherwise jammed, so maybe that takes care of that for 40 runs. Wow. Okay. Well, let's see what that does. Meanwhile, back at the ranch... What is my wayward factory doing to me? Oh, I need to connect my container so I can work in my shutdown factory. Because uh, the game developers figured, hey, you don't need to run a factory. Just mine your ore, man. They make it none too fucking easy. Because they're not here to have fun. You think you're entitled to have fun when you're playing a game? Fuck. In order to actually get some runs out of this thing? Wow, that's amazing. I have products I can pretend to sell. No schematics. Well, I wonder how that happened. All right, so what schematics do I have waiting for me? Uh, here material. Okay, let's read that. Tier 1 XS. Oh, I can run that again. Tier 1 S. Okay. Tier 1 M. All right. I don't know if I runs with that guy. Well, this does slow everything down a lot, man. That is super cool. It's so nice when you can't do much. Because when your economy has too much supply, the main thing you want to do is slow the supply away the fuck down. Which means, in the real world, there never would have been an industrial revolution at all. But why are these things not running? 
Oh, we don't have inputs. Basic power systems. All right, so um, something down here got jammed up, and it's probably my smelters. It's going to be time to give them prints. Yep. So now it's time to do ALFE, and tomorrow when I come back, I might be able to get these machines running. And let's just see. Let's just fill this up with a day's worth of money. That's ALFB. Come back tomorrow because I'm not going to fuck around for eight hours and wait for that paint to dry. And Salumen. We'll put a day's worth of money in. And keep in mind, I can only make five prints at a time. And this is steel. So, I can feed my smelters one day, and the next day, feed my assemblers and flip back and forth, because I can't do more than that. So on the one hand, I really wouldn't have to play this game very much to get the most out of it, because I'm not going to fuck around for eight hours waiting for this shit. Neither am I going to fuck around for two hours, or 60 or 30. I could fuck around for 30 minutes and then put in one run and then go to, and come back and put another run in. Or I can queue it up for eight hours and come back tomorrow. Or just throw my hands in the air and say, fuck it. All right, so I've got three cooking. Let's see if I can get these other two machines to the point where they have prints. Because I've actually got four, five, six, six assemblers. And this takes basic metal works, no schematics. And we're making what here? Uh, all right, so it's a basic assembly line M, so I should just be able to feed it any old M. But since I can't fucking tell what any of these schematics do, I mean, what the fuck do it do? Who the fuck knows? They're not telling you. So you're going to have to waste your time feeding it, a, you know, a schematic, and then you're going to come back when it's done and go, well, fuck, did that 150k I just spent do anything for me? We don't know, and we don't fucking care, jackass. You're here to give us money. We're not here to help you play the game. You're supposed to love the fucking game. You're supposed to just fucking love it. And that's it. Those are all the prints I can make. So, waste a day getting these four prints... Waste a day, the next day, getting smelters and two more assemblers some prints. And in the meantime, I don't really have enough to even fly my ship to market. Now, I do have products saved up. That's not the point of this. This, this is not, not going to justify spending nitron flying around in this little rock.
So you're hitting the game audio, but I am not. I'm not sure why I'm not. Um, maybe I don't need to. I don't know. Maybe I don't care. That's a possibility. All right. Let's, I gotta get this other guy. All right. So now what do we have? You're hearing game audio, but I'm not. That's all kinds of unhappy. Wow. It's always nice when it doesn't load in for like 15 minutes. Let's load in. Did it load in? Oh, oh no. I missed it. I was busy going out for coffee. things, but um, that's going to be it for this particular jaunt through the magical mystery tour of what we were doing, and um, meanwhile, I'm going to work on getting my shit together, which is all kinds of interesting.